Alright, what's going on guys, Mr. Clash here, welcome back to another Clash of Clans gameplay commentary and today I'm going to be posting some awesome clan replays, but more specifically awesome clan loot raids from our couple of our members. So, uh, this whole week guys, um, I've been having a lot of tests, so if I do sound a little tired, I am, but um, yeah, that's, you know, I had finals this week because I am going to be on spring break and I'm sorry about that noise, that was my Twitter notification. Um, so anyway, the first raid is by Dantol, and he's going win, going in with an interesting army. So he's got a golem, then he, he puts the clan castle troops right uh, behind the queen. So it looks like he's got a lot of balloons and a couple of minions. So it looks like a balloonian strategy with a golem and some clan castle troops and an archer queen. So I wouldn't say this was an amazing, crazy loot raid. But I want to give Dantel some credit. This was a pretty awesome raid, at least in my opinion. It was pretty cool to watch. So it looks like that Golem is soaking up a lot of damage um, from the Queen. I think he, I think Dantel wanted to protect um, his Queen, so the Queen could take out a couple air defenses, and I believe she does take care of the bottom air defense right there. Actually, two. I think that was the first one, I believe, or second one. I'm not sure, but yeah, there we go. Dantel sends in the balloons and the minions. So it looks like from this point it's going to be a 3 star pretty easily. Only a Tesla left and there's like 15 or 20 balloons left. So very easy raid uh, by Dantel and pretty good loot out of it. I mean not too bad. He's got around I think yeah 290,000 elixir and around 200,000 gold. Um, so not too bad with the I guess loot bonus is not too bad. So now the second raid is by one of our cl new clan members Lewis. And this is insane. This could have been a 1.2 million loot rate. But obviously Lewis does not get it. He's got level, I believe it's level 5 Barch. And only if he had like Balloonian, Max Balloonian or something, he would have got most of this loot. Or maybe he had carried a couple hounds, but obviously he doesn't have level hounds. So this loot is crazy. I mean, any farmer would really want to... You know, if you don't, if you carry Balloonian, it's gonna be pretty easy for you to get the loot. But if you carry Barge, like Lewis does, you're not gonna get all the loot inside. Um, depends what kind of level, you know, Barge you have. If you have level five, level six, level seven, because different armies could actually make a big difference in terms of getting the loot. So, unfortunately, Lewis cannot. It, it's impossible for him to get all the loot, but he does try to manage to get as much as possible with the amount of troops he has. So I think he does a pretty good job overall. And Lewis does get a lot of dark elixir, so congrats, bro. Um, in gold league, it's not, at least what from my clan members that do farm in gold, they told me it's not as easy to find extremely good loot. I mean, extremely good dark elixir down there. I mean, you can find some, but like Lewis got 3,500, so that was pretty awesome. And the next one's actually a, kind of an older replay um, that I saved, and it was by Josh. From a clan, I don't think he's in our clan anymore, but he used to be in our clan. Um, so, anyway, very good loot, loot raid by Josh. Um, finding these bases, especially in Gold League, is awesome. I did not show any of my raids, but I did actually. I think I have like four straight raids down my log that nothing but loot. So I do find good loot raids up in Masters, um, definitely for sure. But yeah, so um, looks like Josh is gonna is gonna spread his archers and barbarians around the base like lewis and me and a lot of other clan clan members do we carry barge because barge is very, very it's actually the cheapest army you can buy besides all barbarians and get the most loot out of it and you know it's the most effective for the price you get so um, definitely barge is the way to go at least in my opinion i know a couple of guys maybe in our clan that carry balloonian to farm i mean that's not a bad strategy either um, but you gotta really get a lot of loot and probably, you know, farm up in Masters 2 or something. So, anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, these are just a couple loot raids. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna be doing a soon, a collab with another YouTuber. So, stay tuned for that, guys. But if we could smash 40 likes for this video, that would be amazing. And as always, I'll see you all on my next video.